Okay, hi guys, my name's Nikelia and you're here on Nick Knacks News. I have an important I have an important topic to discuss today. I know my face does not say it, but I'm very I don't know what the word is. I'm not angry. I'm upset. I'm disappointed. I'm disgusted. Like I can feel it right here. I'm really peed off. Today was just a usual day in our summer holidays and my family being abroad. I have to, I actually have to I actually have to cross my legs to get into this story because I have an important message. Right. Today was a normal day. Um, me and my brother was having a little discussion. It wasn't an aggressive discussion. It was just, you know, an average brother-sister discussion. Then he decided to call me a B-I-T-C-H. Okay. <sighs> okay. Let's... No, no, I need, to, I need to put my feet on the ground so I don't end up kicking no one. Okay, let's actually sit... No, hold on, I need to pull my hair. Okay. Let us... Let us sit down and actually think about this because a lot of the time people are getting called out of their name and we see it as okay, we see it as it's not completely out of the ordinary, this has become a social norm but it's bang out of order and it's wrong, okay. When me and my brother, when it's not even about me and my brother, it's beyond that. No one, no one has ever called me a B-I-T-C-H. And you have to understand, when people call you out of your name, and when people call you derogatory words, there's great depth and meaning behind it. And people might think I'm going overboard, but at least can you just hear me out? Because I think what he did was out of order, and I legit don't want to talk to him ever again. That's the mood that I am in currently. Like, he took the mick. Right. Think about what a B-I-T-C-H actually is it's a dog so he is calling me a dog he's calling me an animal he's the respect that he has for me is respect equivalent to an animal i am his big sister and again as i said let's take it out of context when people call you out of your name they are trying to belittle you to patronize you to intimidate you and we have to understand that we are not going to stand for this and we need to show people what we're going to tolerate and what we're not going to tolerate i am not going to be tolerated being called a bitch i have never in my life ever been called that and i don't know why he thought that was acceptable i don't present myself like that i don't carry myself like that i don't have that demeanor so for him to actually think that's acceptable it's not and it's not acceptable for anybody to call you that at all and we're not just talking about the b word anything if people are calling you a slag or a slut or fat or dirty or grimy or dumb or intelligent um not intelligent they are trying to belittle you they are intention they have intention to hurt your feelings and for you to then go and talk to them what you fair enough when you first look at it it just appears that oh i'm just talking to them but in actual fact what you're implying to them is i don't mind you calling me that i don't i i'll i will respond to that i'm okay with that i accept that name i take on that title and i don't take on that title i'm not a bitch i'm not and nobody is so for anyone that thinks it's acceptable to call someone that it's bang out of order it's bang out of order to call anybody that I am I'm worthy and I deserve more respect than a fe than a female dog. I'm so sorry, I do. I am more and I am more worthy than being called just fat because I'm not just fat. I'm not just black. I'm not just girl. I'm not just white or just skinny or just hairy. I am me and for you to think that you can just degrade my spirits like that. Oh my gosh, no. For you to think that that's acceptable it speaks a lot it, it screams it screams volumes that you think that's acceptable do i look like someone that would tolerate that really and honestly being called out of your name is something that you accept do you know what what's that saying if someone calls you a b-i-t-c-h oh what's the saying it's not what you're called it's what you listen to or what you run to so do you know what call me that but no no this as far as i'm concerned 
if you think that I'm worthy of that small amount of respect, you're not worth me even being in contact with because I have not worked on myself and moulding myself and, you know, moulding myself into this individual and becoming myself and everybody else that's on their own personal journeys. We're not on these journeys to improve our you know our esteem and our confidence and our acceptance of ourselves for other external people in our environment to come and break us down it will not be tolerated not here it will not nowhere should it be tolerated so yeah that's my little rant i wanted to discuss being called out of your name it's completely unacceptable it's a form of bullying it's out of order it is out of order I think I've covered all my points yeah that's it pretty much basically when somebody calls you that that's they're calling you out of your name you're go even that your parents gave you a name for a reason so who are you now to then call me something below what my parents called me nah sorry not me it's not what you what is it it's not what you're called it's what you listen to and if you think you can listen to and that can also lead into many different things. If you have friends that are calling you these names, they're telling you what their mind conceives of you. They're telling you their perception of you. If you choose to stay there, just know then, just know that you are then responding back to the person that called you that. Yes, I am what you just called me. That's why I'm not, I'm going to ignore my brother for the for however long it takes him to realize and apologize that I'm not a female dog. I am a human. I am a spirit. I am, I'm an energy, I'm, I'm a person, I'm not a dog. <sighs> okay, I'm happy I get, th I got that off of my chest, because that really ticked me off, like, never in my life. Fair enough, I'm only 18, but 18 years is a long time to be on earth, and I've never, e never, ever been called that, so... I took great offence to it, but I had to just let it go because you can't just have those thoughts running in your mind. I was all thinking to kick him down, but that would not be a good person. A good person wouldn't do that. So, yes, I'm getting all the negative energy out. I was thinking about beating him down and like getting a pot and dashing it in his head, but um, I will remain calm. And yeah, I'm really happy I got it off my chest don't only listen to your name if someone wants to call you out of your name and call you beautiful by all means respond if someone wants to call you out of your name and call you wise one or intelligent and in actual fact they're not even calling you out of your name because that is in your future and that is in your destiny okay enough talking now i got what i had to say off my chest i can release i can hoosa i can breathe again without feeling fiery and red inside i'm cool i'm calm right so that's the end of it guys and yes that's it okay bye bye